It's the Line Makers on Sporting News. Welcome to the Line Makers on Sporting News. I'm Micah Roberts with Rick Hare, and here at the beautiful South Point Race and Sportsbook, we're looking at Game Five, Rick, in the Western Conference semifinals. The Thunder, if you've been betting them the last couple of games, I have. you've kind of been screwed, haven't you? Well, yeah, like you know, it's three-one Memphis, but it's actually been a great series. And it's, that sounds funny to say, but every game's come right down to the wire. I mean, Game Two, the Grizzlies had had the 10-0 run with a minute and 58 to play. Game three, it was a tie game with a minute to play, and it fell six. Game four goes to overtime, and Oklahoma City again can't close and gets outscored 9-3 in overtime. Game falls six again. Oklahoma City just can't close in this series. I mean, they're there in every game, but without Russell Westbrook, it's it, it's almost that the Grizzlies know Durant's going to take the shot when the game's on the line. He hasn't been effective. He played 48 minutes. He was two out of 13 in game four in the fourth quarter in overtime. He missed all five shots in overtime. Well, you still got to, at, at the same time, give the Grizzlies credit for yeah, closing out and, and being able to finish. And you love that as a better. And a better, if you've been following the Grizzlies the last nine games, you've covered every game. And, and as improbable no as the covers, series, right. yeah, as improbable as the last two have been, they got the job done when it counted. And what does this do for the Thunder now going into game five here? Does it... Uh, are they deflated? Are they gonna, do they think they can come back? They still got two or three games at home uh, remaining. Do they feel they can make a comeback, or, do, or have they played as well as they can and took their best shot and it wasn't good enough? Well, I heard the press conference with Scott Brooks, and he firmly believes that, that this series isn't over, and all you have to do is get the one at home. You showed you were tied at, with a minute to play or went to overtime both times in Memphis, so you yep. know you can go and get there. And obviously, you got to go get game five. Uh, Oklahoma City opened three and a half, up to a four-point favorite, total of 185. And I said earlier in the series I was going to play the dog in every game in this series, regardless. Yeah. Of who. And that hasn't turned out too well, again, because of the scoring droughts in the last minute with Oklahoma City. But I'm probably leaning towards playing Memphis, plus the four. I don't see any reason not to. They, like you said, they've covered nine in a row. Uh, you know, Conley had 24, Randolph had uh, 23 three. and 12, Gasol 23, 11, and 6 block shots. They're that's good. Amazing. Yeah, no, that's a great uh, trio there that, that came up big when, when they had to and, and impressed the spot there. Series price, uh, Memphis in the spot up 3-1, minus $8 plus $6 for Oakland City. Enough to entice you to take a, a shot on the Thunder with two home Could games? Could be a little value there. You got two out of the three at home. If you figure they're going to get game five, they said, we've already seen they can win in Memphis. They just haven't done it. They haven't closed. But, the, but they've been right there in every game. So uh, my lean's to the dog. And if you like the dog, you kind of got to favor Memphis's pace, I yep. think. Though. Yeah, maybe under the, well, under the 185. All right. There you go. Thanks for watching.